guys, it's Vicky from Inviting Writing here. I'm just going to show you a little step-by-step -step of a cake topper that I'm making this evening with my Cricut machine. So here we go. So first of all, I've just done a really rough copy here. Um, and then from there, I've done the final lettering here. Ella Rose is five. It's now been scanned in to my Cricut Design Space. Uh, it's at the right um, size. And so now I'm gonna make it. So machines going on, I've got it turned around to cardstock because I've got this amazing, amazing, amazing glitter. How gorgeous, pink and sparkly and I love this bit open da, 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 da. okay and now we're going to load it in so now we're ready So we'll pick up with this shortly. So you can just about see the lines cut out. I'm going to do my best to do this one handed. I should be using my weaving tools, but um, my weeding tools, not my weaving tools, sorry. Um, but I'm going to get this on video for you. So. Um, yeah, you get the idea anyway, so we'll pick up with this in a second. So this is definitely a really fiddly part because even though I'm on the light grip um, mat, it's been really, really difficult to actually get, um, you know, because it's quite a delicate piece, it's been really difficult to actually get the card to unstick so I've had to use this and then uh, keep sliding this underneath for fear of ripping the card. Um, I know that it looks like I've done it here, but actually that was that was me doing it intentionally because it, um, that's a bit that I'm going to not be using anyway. And that uh, that bit was a mistake, but that's going to be easily cut off anyway. So, um, yeah, just be aware that it's quite fiddly. Um, so I'll keep going. Okay, so we've got the majority of that off now. So um, I've just put it on some darker card for you to see. So now I'm just going to get rid of the, the inner bits. Um, and then we're nearly done. And there we have it. Ta-da! Well, I have to confess that that is the first ever time I've used my Cricut for card. I've only ever used it for vinyl before and I'm so happy with that. So I'm just going to pop a little stick. Uh, that's how I wrote it so that there was a straight bit in the middle so that that can go into the cake nice and easily. Um, and yeah, that's going to be on top of the cake tomorrow. Yay! So thank you for watching everyone. I've just made uh, this cake topper with my Cricut machine and I'm really pleased with how it came out. So Thanks for watching. Bye.